we started in America's Georgia, and we went over to Vienna, to Hawkinsville, to Chester, Dexter, Dudley. We drove through Dublin. We made it to Scott, Georgia. And our final destination was Adrian. Hello everyone, this is Hubert from Traveling with Hubert. Even though I'm not the Hubert that the channel is named after, I'm still Hubert. Recently, Kathy and I went on a trip, day trip, and we ended up in my hometown of Adrian, Georgia. That's where I grew up, where I graduated from high school. We do a drive through and I point out some places that are important to me. Uh, in the still photos, I label the ones that I didn't make clear in the video. We hope you enjoy this video. If you enjoy the video, we ask that you give it a thumbs up. YouTube likes to see that interaction with uh, the channels. If you subscribe to the channel already, we give you a big thank you. We appreciate you very much. You're special people to us. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, we invite you to subscribe to the channel. It's free. All you have to do is hit the subscribe button. And if you want to get a notification of when we drop a new video, and we usually do that on Sunday mornings, uh, just hit that notification bell. Uh, if you have questions or comments, please leave them down in the comment section of the video description. Uh, share this video with others that might like travel videos. And Kathy and I wish you have a very, very blessed day. We started our journey to Adrian here. And we came past this uh, Adrian housing pond. And we came on into town. I headed this direction. I was going to turn here. But I missed my turn, so I had to come on down here. We turned around here. Came back into town. And came over here turned here and we came up this road uh, Nora Boulevard came up came down uh, South James Street uh, came here went back up came through town again and came out this way Adrian City Limits. That's a yeah, that's the Gillis compound. Is that the what are they farming or what? Um they he had something to do with the Adrian Housing Corporation that made them um, they were pre-built homes they kind of like like real fancy trailers but they were had sheetrock and paneling and all that mm -hmm. you know and they come in two halves put them together way back in the day they still doing that you think? no it's closed Storage units, I didn't know that's new. That's the school. That's where I graduated from high school. We'll do a ride through, a ride and then just go through some of the residential areas. used to run that shop right there. That used to be a gas station, another gas station. Another gas station. They've torn down part of this. It, the old ice plant used to be there. Used to be the shell station right here on the corner. Uh, used to be the Texaco station here and then they come cut the part of it off and made it angled like that. City Park used to have a pool here, but it's closed. 
the Dollar General's new. The man who owned the Clover Farm, the local grocery store, mm -hmm. that's where he lived. These apartments you're going to see up here on the right, they weren't here when I went to school here. got to go to uh, uh, Swain's World. Yeah, this place is closed. And where do you go if you go that away? Swain's World, Georgia. Is it very far? Uh, about 20 miles, 25 miles, something like that. It's further than we want to go today, honey. Mm -hmm. This used to be the shortcut. You coming down to town and you want to go to Swainsboro, mm -hmm. you'd come down this street rather than go down to the red light. Abandoned house, abandoned trailer. It's a nice little looking house. Mm -hmm. Looks like a nice little community except another house that's those both look like they might be abandoned. I, I don't think anybody's living in those two. Looks like that might have been government houses, honey. If you go out this way, mm -hmm. you go to Wrightsville, Georgia. Somebody put in a concrete slab over there. I don't know. I'm, I'm sure they're going to put something on it. assure you this is all changed. Changed, changed, changed. Looks nothing like it did when I was here. Is abandoned, ho overgrown. Baptist church, I was baptized in that church. Did your mom and daddy get up and go to church every Sunday? Daddy was more faithful about going than mama did. She usually stayed home and cooked. So you went with your daddy? Yeah. I did. Margaret and Curtis and Doris go? Well, they were already out of the house. Oh, they were out, okay. 
Yeah, they used to have a little theater here. Uh, it says Adrian Community Center now, Farmhouse Cafe. Those buildings that were over there where that vacant lot is, like I said, they've been torn down. They were businesses here when I, I was here. That place looks like a post office, but it don't say. No, no, it's what not. What is it? Uh, I think it was a city hall, but I think they've moved into the old bank building. I mean, it doesn't really say post office, but no. it kind of looks... No, the post office was down there on the corner. We rode by it, honey. We'll go back by it. They don't have to say it's a post office. See, welcome to the city of Adrian's. I think they've moved into the old yeah. bank building. residential area. It's always been a fancy house to me with the chain. Mm -hmm. Everybody's got Jesus on their porch, is it? Our principal used to live here, I think. No, 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 no. Sorry about that. But he lived on this street, not that house. Now, in other places we've been, these have been speed humps, honey. But look, this says speed bump. Mm is all back down to the left. So I'm not riding down in there. They're just houses. Another house that's empty. Another house that's empty. Well, I, it's got a car and a carport and rocking chairs. But um, I think it's I think it's, <laughs> I think it's empty. <laughs> And we didn't get a warning about that one, honey. We don't know whether it's a speed bump or a speed hump. Coach lived right there. He drove a 1963 gold Corvair. An ag, uh, FFA ag person lived there in that brick house. I'll show you where the post office has always been there, unless they've moved it. Just about. There's no nothing. No. All the businesses have closed. Post office right here on the corner. And the person that was the postmaster lived in that house right here. Mm. And he was the brother to the man who owned the uh, grocery store. this church here on the right. Right there. Mm -hmm. It's just uh, a few people who are left, honey, and that's about it. That's it, honey, and that's gonna do it for this video.